What's up, everybody? I am Snickenhoff, and we are back playing some more Duelist today. And we have got Magmar. It was Vitruvian, but I feel like I played some Vitruvian a lot recently, so we'll go with Magmar. And we're going to revisit the Starhorn Burn deck. Um, seen some changes uh, since the patch and the nerfs have come out, so we're just going to roll with uh, kind of a new build of it. I looked it up, but I can't forget. I can't remember who to give credit to. I apologize immensely. But we're playing against graphics. Like, is it is it a person named Graphics, or is it just the concept of graphics that we're playing against? I hope it's the second one, to be honest with you. But um, what do we want to throw back? I kind of like this hand the way it is, almost. Maybe even running both of these out on turn one with Flash Reincarnation. Or maybe flashing out this guy in natural selection and something. Yeah, I think I'm just hold on to it. Uh, I think I learned from the last time around that I this is a card I kind of never want to mulligan. Hello. Why hello, sir? Hello. Sunwisp. I've been seeing a lot of Sunwisps lately. Is it just because I'm in silver? Or is this like a card people are playing nowadays? I am not sure. I mean, it is... It's a... If you can, especially if you can get a kill with it, like it's kind of a two for one, in a way. Oh, it's opening gambit draw card, not the other way around. Yeah, let's just uh, hit him with the tempo. And I don't mind throwing away cards, especially with as much card draw I have in my hand. Maybe I should have placed Blazehound because it would have burned a card off of him. Probably would have been a good idea, but I wasn't thinking about that, so that's my reasoning. Okay, Maw. Do we have something else to kill it as well? True Strike. And smack that. Smack that. Definitely moving up to here. I think I replace this Blood Tear. Decimus. Should I run out the Decimus now? and then have all this burn ready to go. Um, I'm actually kind of thinking about not, because it's possible I could like flash him out next turn. Flash him out and play Tectonic Spikes, just to deal a ton of damage, so I think I'm just going to play the Blaze Hound. see if I'll... We'll see if that plan was good or not, depending on the removal that he has. I mean, if he has no removal, then the Decimus was better. But if he does have removal, then this is better, so... Pre-nerf slow into Holy Emulation. No? Not, that's not the play? Another Maw, so that's two Maws down. Arclight Sentinel. Um, I kind of want to play this Decimus in a safe spot. So I may not flash him out, I just may just come down to here, play him here, and use my hero power. Seems fine. Or I could... Come down here, play him here, flash out the Blaze Hound and Hero Power. That would cause him to burn a card. The dancing blades down. And then he can either take four to the face or remove it with this, which then I'm kind of just trading one for one with it. So I think that's all fine. Draining wave. Okay. Not the best, not the worst. 
after blaze. That's not great, but I could uh, something wave it. A lot of things. Place is greater fortitude. Right quick. Thumping wave here. Attack here. Play grow here. This should target me first. So that's all right. I mean, I could have just natural selection this instead of thumping my bit, but to be honest, now that I think about it. That's a little unfortunate. scared of what he could be what he could do to me on the next turn and by a little I mean a lot I messed up that thumping wave play for sure Does this deck run any eggs it's got young sleazy I guess dust walker damage to all enemies in front of this. Wow. Wow. The old Duskwalker blood to your alchemist loss. Jeez. Was not expecting that. Okay. Uh, definitely just played some things there. I am still in silver. I apologize. I'm so sorry. I wish I wasn't. You and me both, pal. Yeah, I know. Stop it. That's mean. Anyways, let's go on to game two. Um, I do kind of feel like it takes me a few games to get used to playing a deck, which is unfortunate that I play almost uh, play a different deck almost every single day. Um, but there's something coming tomorrow that just trying something new out. So uh, maybe change up the way we do things. X dem fiend X demi fiend X was just demi fiend taken. Maybe it was? I don't know. Um... So if I, I replace this, if I don't draw a two drop, then I play this on the first turn. Those were the days. Fireblaze Obelisk. Well, I've got a natural selection I would love for you to meet. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and throw one of these back. It's fine.
No, sir. You may not. Stop it. Falcius. Can you do the four to me? Okay. Um, I could just shroud that guy, but I'm not. I don't think I need to quite yet. Let's replace this blood tier. Flash. I mean, I could flash out of a canter, but it doesn't really do anything. I could move him down here, flash out the mechanter here, and attack both of them into it. Come up here and draw a card. Is that really what I want to do, though? And it feels like I'm investing a lot into just killing this thing. I could just ephemeral shroud it. I could save the ephemeral shroud or something else. But I could save the mechanic for something else as well. Yeah, we're just gonna have Femoral Shroud. Second Tectonic Spikes. Nimbus. That's a card. Okay, so it's whenever he takes damage. at all. He would be one, like, even if I invested, like, everything into hitting this as well, he'd be one damage away from death, and we'd just make a billion obelisks this turn. Don't think I want to do that. My goal is to be able to deal with as many of these obelisks as I can in one go with my canter. Valkyus. Yes, make a nice box for me. question is, becomes here, is do I risk it for the biscuit? Because I could come up here and attack this guy. And as long as it, like, if the, if the obelisk spawns anywhere but here, it's fine. I guess if it even spawns here, it's fine. I just can't hit that. Yeah. Here would be the obelisk.
spawned another one. I think I want to get rid of it. Oh yeah, it kills anything that hits it, I forgot about that. Why would you attack it with that? Attack it with anything else that would stay alive. Oh, also I attacked the wrong thing with, yeah, McCanter. But I think it didn't matter with McCanter. There's all three of his Falciuses and Inner Oasis. Fantastic. Well, this video is going great so far. I do just need 12 damage to kill him. And I can't find a Decimus to save my life. Um... I'm just going to build a wall. Alright, there's six damage. I just need six more. There's the Decimus. I can win next turn. I think. This is six, seven, eight. So I have to not die this turn. Oh, but then I kill myself. I can get a draw next turn. Mess that up. Gotta move this guy. Pax. Saber Spine Tiger. Science for Swish. I mean, do I just go for the draw? Oh, but now I can't. I can only like one. Poop nuggets. And I can't play anything anywhere. Well, I could kill this. See if we can do this. I think this is going to end up being a draw. Like, I don't. Unless I get, like, a curse here. Yeah, we'll just, pl we'll just get the draw. that in the wrong order, but it didn't matter anyway with the cards I drew. But I think I should have gone for... Uh, I should have gone for the, the Entropic Gaze before I did my Hero Power. Alright, what do we got this time? Um, I don't even love throwing that back. I may just hold on to this whole hand. Atro. Other than red... I was trying to think of a flower. Sort of, oh, I'm sure there is one. I just can't think of it off the top of my head, so. Am I getting a natural selection of this? I think the answer is yes. Just to, at least for the fact that this won't die. Uh, at least, without outside interference next turn. Oh, yeah, I drew the so far. I was like, did I have that the whole time? No, no, I did not. Stop it. Yeah, bro. He is thinking. He 
does the think. Is he going to play cards? I think he should play cards. Well, I'm kind of torn on the idea. I'd be fine with him not playing cards as well. Does this turn really rely on that cryptographer that hard? I mean, you take five if you do it like this. You need to decide, bruh. Battle pets go! Four mana. Kinda wanna replace something. It feels a little dirty replacing that, not gonna lie to you. for me. A second Azure Herald is really bad news for me. And he could have done an extra damage to me, so at least there's that. Am I on 5 or am I on 6? I'm on 5. I want to be on 6. Can I please be on 6? I think I'm going to play this. And then decide what to do. burned two cards from him, but he did get a Decimus, which I could play, but I don't think that's the best course of action at the moment. Reset him. Ah, I forgot to attack here. Poop. Poop nuggets. Perp nuggets. He, he just dies next turn, this turn anyway. Hit, hit, hit. Nope, not going with that. Going with that mana tile. Third Azure Herald. Okay, well, they're all gone. Jeez. Of course, when I'm playing a burn deck, dude gets like 17 Azure Heralds. Sunseer. And now the question becomes, where do I want to play my Mechanter? And I think it's up here. I think it's literally right here. I think that was a smart choice. Six damage on board, tons of damage in the hand. Plasma Storm. That is fine. You plasma Storm an egg. That's literally all you did. play cards, man. I mean, I need to learn how to play cards, too. But, uh, he's dead this turn. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's just dead. Gonna play it a little safe, just to make sure, but... Alright, we got a win. We have a win, a loss, and a draw. Let's see what game four brings us.
I mean, that's one of the things that's nice about this deck is like once they're down to like under 15, you can just win out of nowhere. Out of nowhere! Dolgrut. Dolgrut. Hey y'all, my name's Dolgrut. Uh, sweet. No turn one plays. It's, I like Greater Fortitude as a card. I really do. But sometimes it's just so bad. I can't, I can't keep... There's no reason to keep it. I have literally no reason. I'm also not sure how I feel about Lava Land. Deck. I mean, now that I have a Young Slithar, I feel a little bit better about it. But that's the only card that can pr trigger it. Like, we don't even have Egg Morph, so we can trigger it for them. I'm, I'd have to reread Lava Lands. I'm not sure if it's any egg on the field or if it's just one of your eggs. It may be just one of your eggs. That's real obelisk. Catches me the one time without natural selection. Sand Trap. Okay. Um, I need to find the natural selection if I can. I did not. Decimus is nice. Now I wish I had that. Uh, wish I had that. What? Who's the one wants it back? Uh, Flash reincarnation. We could like kill him in the next two turns. Fireblaze Obelisk. That's a little annoying. Um, what to do? Let's replace this grow. Get a blood tier alchemist. Not really what I was looking for. Not going to lie to you. Oh, he just cannot move. That's right. That's right. Well, then we're going to use him as a human shield. Card, greater fortitude is fine. He could blood of air this, and that would be unfortunate. Doesn't look like he's got blood of air this turn though. Holomancer. Pyromancer. Kill that. I feel like we would need to. Uh let's replace this grow. Ephemeral Shroud. Might not be bad to throw that there. I want to play this Blood Tier Alchemist. I think I'm going to play this Ephemeral Shroud here so I don't take a billion damage from Obelisks. Run this guy away. And then I can play Tectonic Spikes. Or even just Entropic Gaze. Actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to come up to here. This guy's running this way. Play this. Here. Play this here. Attack here. And a drop against. Uh, the second Decimus. Alright. And a flash reincarnation. Take some damage next turn. I'll be on six, so I could play this and this with the Flash Reincarnation. Seems pretty good.
time with all this. Play, probably playing another uh, oh, a Starfire Scarab. Not exactly fine with that. Iron Shroud. No, 15. Let's go ahead and replace this. Unfortunately, we can't double flash. Although that would kill it, so. I think I am going to do this, though. I'm going to play the dude here so that the Starfire Scarab can't, get, can't hit both. Tectonic Spikes. Maybe dead this turn. Like yeah. yeah, he is. Oh, I can't get to get to Well, alright, we went 2, 1, and 1. Not bad. Um, I still enjoy the deck. I enjoy playing fast and lose like that. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, feel free to hit that like button down below as well as subscribe to the channel and leave me a comment. Between Starhorn and Vath, who's your favorite? Like, we all know Vath is better, but who's your favorite? Anyways, thank you guys so much for joining me, and I will see you next time.